Hey, what's up, guys? It's me again. It's Nathan Burton. Also known as Beasley Aaron Andre. You call me whatever you want because I know you'll do it anyway. What's up? Something new I'm trying because I'm bored. I have nothing else to do in lockdown right now. And what I've been trying to do, but I don't have access to a computer at the moment. Um, see how this works. I'm not really big on that commentary channel shit, but I'm going to do what I can. I mean, if you got interesting stories to tell, like Luna, that's one thing, but not all this dumb shit where it's like, oh, hey, uh, uh, New Leaks about this new game that I can't show you in this video for legal reasons. Which translates to real, what they're really saying is, uh, I'm desperate for fucking views, so, uh, they're, they're bullshit. The point is they're bullshit, everybody. They don't got no fucking new leaks about anything. They tell that to everybody to get fucking attention, and that's pretty much why I hate commentary channels. It's the same shit, that, or it's just somebody talking shit about somebody else. Sounding like a fucking 13 year old with their dumbass 13 year old fucking jokes. They, motherfuckers still sound like they're still stuck in the fourth fucking grade. It's ridiculous. It's sad because a group of 4th graders are smarter than most kids who are on YouTube this, this day and age. From the fucking age of 18 to fucking 30. Oh my god, they just keep getting fucking stupider. So yeah, let's see where this goes. I mean, if you do commentary channel, I mean, I get that's your thing. But again, you gotta do something decent like Luna. Luna fucking tells stories about his stupidity and all the dumb shit he's gotten into. He doesn't try to bullshit it like a lot of people accuse him of. I don't think he's bullshitting anybody. I just think that, you know, people like to talk shit for views. That's all motherfuckers do anymore. Like, hey, watch your mouth. God, I hate that dumb motherfucker. God, I hate that guy. <laughs> I mean, I know someone's going to say, well, you're talking shit right now. I'm not talking shit. I'm just giving my opinion. That's not what they do. They just blatantly say, well, this person sucks and fuck them because, and you know, and it's over, always over dumb shit. What I'm saying is because the shit I've heard, like, and it, especially these dumb motherfuckers who make, oh, this person's a virgin. I bet you're a virgin. Preach you, you're a virgin. Okay, dude, we get it. You ain't getting none, so you're going to assume no one else is and turn that into a joke trying to, well, cover up the fact that you ain't. Why am I not getting on right now? It's because my wife is living with her family until she finishes school. <laughs> I love my wife dearly, and I never cheat on her like I know she would never with me. And I know somebody's going to watch this and make those dumb jokes like, Huh, I'm already doing shit to her. I bet she's already... Shut up. Okay, just shut the fuck up and come back when you got a better insult. Nothing more insulting than a bad insult, because... That's even more insulting than the insult. I mean, that's not me trying to be funny. I'm being serious. It's more insulting to get poorly insulted than getting actually insulted. My God, it's just this never-ending vicious fucking circle. I mean, there's an end to it, but please, God, find a loophole soon. God, dude, I need more to talk about. I mean... When I came on here, I didn't realize the stock footage was going to be like seven minutes long. So uh, I'm trying to fill in the silence. And uh, God, I wish I had more to talk about than just trying to lose weight that I packed on since I've been in lockdown. Since, you know, I had to ride like fucking half an hour to work on a bike through heavy traffic when it was hot. Or fucking, I even rode there in the rain. You're welcome, Bob Evans. I mean, don't get me wrong. I'm thankful I got to eat. Like, you know, I was at a paycheck I could eat. You know, don't get me wrong. I'm thankful, but like fucking... So it sucks, especially when fucking Mark, this fucking, I think his name was Mark, this dumb motherfucker manager. Is, God, I hate this guy. I hated this guy and this head manager motherfucker, but that's a video for another day. Hey, look at that. I got something to talk about. All right, but hey, to people who haven't heard it all. All right, good to know. Okay. But I'm serious, though. Like, you know, losing, besides losing weight and shit, I, I need more to talk about. But then again, I just realized the problem. I just realized the solution to the problem. I do. I just got to tell it to other people who probably don't care, but. That's okay. One of you's gonna care because one of you's gonna know what it's like. A few of you are gonna know what the hell it's like to have to ride to work all that like fucking bike when it's like fucking raining or hot or fucking cold. You wipe out on your fucking bike. So that else fucked up and uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, so uh. I mean, even trying to get famous through the job story, I mean, we all have been there through, like, our first job, which was, like, a shitty job you work or something like that, because my first job was pretty shitty, like, I think anyone else's would be. But still, though, I mean, you know. But another rant for another day. Can't wait, though, to be honest. Glad I know someone's going to fucking hear me. Besides people who have already heard it, you know. I mean... Fucking seriously, it was a fucking... Outside of that, what are y'all up to during lockdown? Just doing what I'm doing, playing video games and stuff in your face? 
looking for dumb shit to fill in time, trying to get your life back on track, especially when all this shit's over. <coughs> and God knows I am. I'm just trying to get things back going again. Sorry about the quick silences, just taking a minute to breathe. I mean, you know, just Got a couple of kittens from my cat, Uka, in here. Uh, obviously, you can't see her, but still, uh, yeah, just been sitting around pantsless, you know, watching, uh, I've been play playing video games, you know, watching movies, YouTube, all that shit, just praying to God for all this to end soon and just everything go back to normal. You know, the usual, it's, you know, if you believe in God. But still, though, I'm getting through it. I already did that video how I, th I said, you know, better than I thought it'd be. Uh, far better than I thought it'd be. Things are easing up, though. Go back to normal soon. Not really ready to turn 24 next month. And, oh, God, it's creeping up on me. It's the 27th, is it not? It's, oh, God, I only got, like, got two weeks and two days left. Oh, God, I got two weeks and two days left. Here we go, I guess. You know. And I ain't even gonna lie. I think of anything. Anybody would say, like, oh, I want to get laid. I want to do this and that on my birthday, 24th birthday or whatever. I mean, yeah, I do too. But, uh, dude, like I said, I want this all to be fucking over. And most of all, I want to have a fucking baby. I want to be a father. You know, I don't want a fucking new game system. I don't want any of that. I don't want any of the new shit just yet. I want to enjoy, it all just feels fucking generic to me, but I'll get back to that another rant. Try not to put out too much of those, because, you know, saving those for other videos, I'm going to put out with this one. Uh, yeah, I guess that's it for now. Yeah, hope to God the spills in the space. All right, thank you for listening to my pointless and dumb ramblings. Maybe not pointless to me, maybe not pointless to others, but yeah, whoever you are, though, who the hell cares? All right, see you around, then.